Hello and welcome to this episode of How to Tutorials by Leventure Studios. My name is Lydia and in this video I'm going to show you how you can make your particle air system follow your rig in Blender. I'll be using Blender 2.91 for this video and let's get started. <music> So I'll be using this character for this tutorial, her name is Joy and you can see here Joy has this particle air system and the first thing you need for your air system to follow your rig is that the, um, the air mesh must be assigned to the armature. For instance, let me select the air, you see that we have the armature um, modifier here, so if I deactivate this you see there is no more following the rig so that's the first thing so in case you don't know how to rig i'm going to leave a link in the description below on how you can rig your character with rigify in the video we talked about how to uh, rig then another video i'm going to leave the link in the, in the description below about how to weight paint your character so you can to so add weight paint to your character then another video on how to transfer weight so in case you have another mesh like in this case this air is another mesh so in case you want to transfer weight from maybe the body to the air, you can get the link in the description. So make sure there is amateur assigned to your character. So in case you want to do, in case you don't have this, your particular system would not follow your rig. That was the first thing. Then the second thing is that the particle air system must be below the amateur. So if I take this up, you see, it is not following, and that's because it calculates the air particle first, then the armature. When you have the air um, below, it calculates the armature first, then it now puts the particle air system on top of where the armature is. So if the armature is here, it's going to put the air at that point, and if the armature is here, it's going to apply the particle air system at that point. So make sure your particle air system is below the armature. And make sure you have an uh, a rig assigned to your mesh. So it's as simple as that. Those two things are the most important thing. Particular system should be below the armature, and you must have an armature for it to follow your rig. So that's it for this video, and I hope you've gained one or two things from this. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, comment, and share. Click on the notification bell to get notified every time we upload videos like this. And until next time, stay true to your creativity. Bye-bye.